with all due respect. With 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 all due respect. With all due respect. With 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 all due respect. With all due respect. With 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 all due respect. This is the With All Due Respect podcast presented by Mo Knows with your girl Lady Snow. It's Nick Fly and me, your main man Mo. We have another performer here from uh, the Elfin Group, actually Elfin Group's first signee. We're here at Siege's uh, album release party, free concert, heavy. So right now, we're going to speak to Mr. Al. How's it going, sir? Phenomenal, man. Tonight was, it was an experience. Um, and the presence of God is always an experience. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, we had to to your life. He's a, he's a change specialist, you know what I'm saying? Sure. Jesus never intends on uh, leaving a person in the same condition that he finds him, you know what I mean? And I'm a, and I'm a witness to that, personally, you know? Uh, so whenever I come into an atmosphere like this, I'm, I'm always challenged. Like when I leave, like, yo, because every day, there's always uh, opportunity to do either the right thing or the wrong thing. make right decisions or wrong decisions. I've made a lot of wrong ones, you know what I mean? So now I want to dedicate my, my life to doing the right thing. You know, we met, we met about five years ago and when I spoke to you in the park lot as we was actually entering the building. What I found out oh, was, was, was very soft-spoken out in the park lot. Very soft-spoken. When you got behind that microphone, it was a whole nother voice that came out. Like a complete it was like, whoa. And I was like, and this is not my first time seeing you perform. It's the second time, again, a friend of ours, a mutual friend of ours, Justin. And you had the second verse on that. I was like, money went in on that. So just give us a little backstory about yourself again. Is this right here where you find your piece at the point where you let it all out? Almost like bring it to the. Yeah, yeah. I'm on fire. You know, I have fire because so much that's about me throughout the weekend. And of course, people are in contact with our first two. You know, that's just, you know, but when I know I got the, I got the floor, I got the green light, man. You know, um, I'll let God do what he do. You know what I'm saying? I let God do like right now. I'm still, you know what I'm saying? Like, get home. It's gonna take me a while just to calm down. You know what I'm saying? But that's what God do, and I appreciate him for that. So I appreciate him for that. You know, but I have to go forward. I have to get shot first. I have to get sent in 15 years, 25 and a half years in the century first. I had to be strong, got on crack on okay. Sometimes three, four days, no sleep first. I had to witness my mother shot 14 times first. You know what I'm saying? And she's still alive. Her bullets in I had to come up in the roughest hood, field press, nipple tag first. You know? Mama gave me up at five. My grandma raised me. You can bet she did. My grandma made magic for those things. That's the hard way. You know what I mean? That was the bar. That was the bar. Real life as well. She made magic for those things, man. You know? And, and, and I understand now when she used to make us sit at that table, shut your mouth, don't talk, you eat that food. Because she struggled for it. Yes. She struggled for it. You know? That's what we eat. You can tell, like, if you were sitting there rapping, that it was very. You're very passionate, and like I said, you could tell that it's overcome you. And again, you're hearing the music, the story, that you had a story to tell. Like I said, you had to go through all that. Like you said, this is to bring other people out as well. And clearly, when you're rapping, or ministry is just saying, it's, it's putting a word, and it's definitely putting a feeling with the people that's actually And I think it's amazing too because you're putting a different face. Because you know, there's so many people I feel that are gonna look at me so look at this interview, just like just see my genius, so you know what I see myself in. And a lot of times I think a lot of people like to get away from it because they see So I really, really felt your music. And one question that I did have is who inspired you as a rapper? Because I'm not tell you, I'm not big on like rap, but I do like that old school. If I can like the lyrics and stuff and I can vibe, oh I'm with it. And I was with it. And it was like, oh my God. So who inspired you? Like what what who do you think you have for me? Uh, it's a definitely combination of, of Nas and Pop. Nas and Pop. Because because um the lyric the, the lyricism I, I would say Nas, you know what I'm saying? The flow. But 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 when it comes to speaking what's real, what's right, what's true, you know, coming from the heart, that's pop. 
You know what I'm saying? Like, before I went pops. But, but, but it was bad for me. It, it, it went hard because I was thought down. Told pistols in school, high school. I'm ninth grade, man. Smallest thing. But pistols in my locker. You know what I'm saying? So, so, so it was bad for me. But just like I said, I listened to Pac and pray for better days. And God just used that as a prop so he could set the stage. You know what I'm saying? So he gave me that fire through the court. But at the same time, I didn't know how to face it. So I, was, so, so, so I would go in the wrong direction. I had the fire. I had that burning fire. But, but, but at the same time, it was directed toward the wrong things. You know, I was the I wanted to be the wrong guy. You know, I used to walk like that. You know, anybody roll up and hit it on the top of the smallest thing, you know, but I, I, you know, back then, you know what I'm saying, right now, I'm all peace, all love, you know, all peace, all love, you know, but yeah, definitely a uh, combination of um, Nazi Jones and, um, and Tupac. I like Lady Simone was saying, for someone that likes the classic rap and is also a Christian, you're that perfect balance for someone. You can bring her to into rap. Well, this could be actually a merger that works for her. She can actually listen to you, still feel comfortable listening to the music. So again, things that actually bring balance that's needed. Like, that's definitely, definitely a different face to that kind of rap, and people need that. Right. And, 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 and that's definitely it. You know, because you do have people that, that shut it off automatically because it's rap. Yep. You know what I mean? Oh, you know what I mean? Like right. Right. You know what I'm saying? But, but I'm telling you, I'm, I'm giving you the transformation of God in, 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 in 16 bars. You know what I mean? How can you do that? You know what I'm saying? How can you tell me how I'm the king? You know, when I give it to you, you know, when, when God inspires me to give it to you like that, you know, this is real. I don't, I don't follow no trend. I don't, I don't, I don't follow what everybody else. I could. I could easily, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I, started, I started writing yeah. for the Lord in prison. You know, uh, I, I got stuck in 07. I started rapping for the Lord in uh, 2010. I started preaching to prostitutes at Paris. There were three guys. I preached for three years. Three years. And they, they, some of them are going home. You know, about 20 years ago. My homie still, he been on Messenger now, and he got three life sentences. Just lost his last appeal. My homie lost his last appeal. You know what I'm saying? They all listen to my music. And they you want to know it. Al Harris? This is music. They, uh, Minister Farrakhan said himself, like, that the rap is some of the new pastors now. And actually, so the Jackie. following is bigger than the pastors. So the I fact that they're mixing the two, really it shows that the actual message is delivered. And again, the book yeah. yeah. becomes like, oh, like, nice hat, nice look. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I was yeah. listening to him for a little bit. Like, you, you can see a video, <laughs> yeah. right there, you sit there talking, you're clicking. It's based off of it looks like something you're familiar with. And then right. you actually listen to it and you get the words. Right. So again, I, I agree with Mr. Perry. Yeah. With that. Definitely. I'm going to pull my chain out. So, 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 <laughs> <laughs> so my big homies from the hood, man, they know what's up, man. You know, right. and, and, you know I got a lot of love from the hood, man, because they see me out there when I used to be on the block. Hitting the out outside. You know what I'm saying? They, 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 they seen that. They seen that firsthand. So now when they see this, they're like... But it gives them hope. It's got to be God. Yeah, it got to be. Because he, he was out yeah. there, out there. Right. I mean, all robbers, he was out there, you know, but now, you know, Mary, he's closing down his wife, man, kids running around, living, and it's not easy, and it's not easy. I believe the more that you were entangled in the past, the harder it is now that, that, that you, that you, 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 you have to constantly change. A lot of people think that just because you get, and you know, that you get into Christ, it's going to be easy, but it's not. It's not. You know, I think if it gets a little harder. It gets a whole, it's a whole lot harder just to keep that faith and to not, because it's so easy to kind of go back because you got a lot of people that pull you back. There's not a lot of people that's going to pull you to and that don't see the vision that you see and don't see what God has put you in and say, you know what, I want you to walk in this. When they don't see that and they don't understand that you don't have those people to bring you. So it's easy to say, you know what, but I know what happened when I just kind of went and did this little bit. So therefore, I'm just like, like I say, I was just amazed. I was blown away by this entire night. You guys put a face, like I say, just a, it's a different image. It's a different image, and it's just like the magnitude of people in church and just change. It's the show, like God saying, walk into who I want you to be. Even if it's different, it doesn't make sense to nobody else. Exactly. It makes sense to me. Exactly. In the book of Samuel, Saul he said, you, you don't think I can profile with someone else who's got a right machine, so put this on. The verse says that I, I'd have honored David, Mr. Omar, walked around, and he came back to Saul, and said, I can't wear this. I know, I know, this is the way it's been done. Historically, this is the way it's been done. Traditionally, this is the way it's been done. But I can't do it like this. I can't fight my battles like everybody 
much more than five months. But you, if you let me use what God give me, if you put me in that booth and give me a hot beat, I promise I'll slay that giant. So that giant of depression. Yeah. That, that giant of low self esteem. That, that giant of resentment, of anger, addiction. What's your name? I, 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 can, I, I can slay that giant. If you just let me in the booth, let me use what God gave me. You know, I, I, I had to learn a long time ago. I had to learn what woman to take off and not to allow others to impose on me that they need to come down. Because just because it works for you doesn't mean it's going to work for you. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, one more question for you right now. We're going to let you go. By you being the first signee to the Dolphin Group and y'all are growing rapidly, I'm going to hold a conversation with the season. Do you feel any pressure as far as you know what? I'm going to spare you in this thing right now. Nah, if anything, man. No lie. And this, and this, and this, and this is just. Nah, it ain't, it ain't pressure. It ain't pressure at all. It's so much time. Because you know, see, heavy. See, just drop heavy. I'm ready to drop all the time. You know, I just dropped it for a But I'm ready to drop all the time. You know what I'm saying? It's still sharp and still. It's competitive. Well, I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. Well, I hate that. No, but no, no. But, but, but at the same time. Yeah, it, it brings us the best. And it is, it is, it is, it is. But so many times it can be taken. Yes. You know what I mean? Just for different people. For somebody who's mature like you, you understand, then it's just different. But for, you know, for us, you know, it's like, because, because after that, hostility comes when they're disappointed. You know what I'm saying? It's those that can separate it as a sport and actually be real life. This, this is just exactly. friendly sport. Exactly. exactly. So it, it, it is, it is. Uh, Proverbs 27, 17. Uh, that's my man. And, and, and just by seeing him, and I know that he, you know, and I, I'm pushing heavy, I'm pushing heavy. Will I get my boys a game? <laughs> you know what I mean? I love seeing my brother. There's something else that I saw here, and I didn't let y'all ask. We have Reggie Rogers here. We got Siege here. We have you here. And all y'all came together. Y'all hugged. And you and Reggie had a, a long time to go race each other. This was wild. Siege was on the mic calling everyone out. I love to see that unity right there. It's, it's deeper than music. It's God. It's, it's, it's deeper than music for us brothers. Yeah. Because we can get together off, off the stage. We can just get together on the stage and, 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 and be real. And just be real. You know what I mean? And just be us. You know, and, and you know, at the same time, um, we love God. But 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 you can't expect me to have the spirit in, in the line in the line with the line on that's only two uh, dashes. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yo, I'm ready to go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> go for another rest of the day. You want us to go for it? Social media, where you find her? You have a clothing line as well. So, yeah, shout out all King. that information. Fit for King clothing line, man. We got the uh, one apparel dropping real soon. Uh, I'm on Facebook, Al Harris. Uh, Instagram, Al underscore E underscore Harris. Uh, you know, hit me up, contact me. You know, get in touch with me. Um, I'm here. I'm here. I'm, I'm exposed. I'm open. I'm responsible, man. You'll be surprised. Appreciate you, brother. Appreciate you, brother. <laughs> no doubt. We'll be in touch. All right, no man. doubt. All right, man. I love you, man. Thank you. Yes, Thank sir. You.